I am emotionally drained, exhausted. Around 4.30 today, I was making dinner in the kitchen. It had been a wonderful day. Things were great. And my children come, they're playing outside in the back. What is Gracie barking at? I don't know, baby. You can go check. All I hear is screaming. And I, you know, you moms know, you know when your kids are hurt and when it's just playing. Sometimes it gets you like, is, are they okay? And then you're like, oh yeah. But you know when there's something wrong. And it was screaming, running up the deck. I can't, I didn't even, I dropped everything I was doing and ran. And when I got to the deck, my oldest runs in and he's holding his finger and he's screaming, Joel, Joel. So I thought something awful happened to Joel, but then Joel comes up after him and all this is like registering as it's happening. I'm like, his fa he's holding his hand. <laughs> She's a crazy dog. So all I think is bee stings. And I get him in the house and I close the door and I feel something sting my arm. And I run to the other side of the room and I start taking their clothes off and I feel something sting my leg. And I'm running <laughs> down the hallway, taking their shirts off. They're screaming, still getting stung. Go into my bedroom. I see the, it turned out to be yellow jackets flying in our bedroom. So we run into their bedroom and there's like clothes, trails of clothes throughout the house. And then we finally get to their bedroom. All that's left is their shorts to take off. And I notice another yellow jacket on Joel's shorts. So I fold them over and I crumple them up and put them in the closet. And thankfully my mom at this point comes running. She got stung twice on her face and on her arm. And she starts, you know, she's like, where'd you see them? Where are they in the house? And she starts hunting them down to try to kill them. And I mean, the panic, the feeling in my heart, my chest, my head, everything. It was just like, how can I calm my kids down, you know, and not um, make them panic more than they're already panicking. They were crying so much. <laughs> As you can see, everything's better now. But man, it was so scary and yeah, so, my stomach so hard. Still hurts, mama. Your stomach does? No, I meant my thumb. Oh, your thumb. Yeah. Can you show us your bite? Hmm? Can't see it very well. My thigh is on fire. It hurts really bad. It's just like throbbing and it looks worse than any of their bites. So Ivan got one bite. I got two bites. My mom got two bites. And I think Joel was their target. He got like 14 bites. Um, apparently they were in the backyard where they always play. These things must have built their little nest in the last day or two. And they were playing with their target and the target fell over on top of what I'm assuming or near where their nest was. And then uh, Ivan felt something and just started running. And then Joel stayed swinging a stick. And my husband was telling me that pheromones are sent out. They're released to each other to tell the other yellow jackets come sting this, you know, and it was Joel. So they totally got my little boy. So now, Daddy's home. We're all safe. There's one left in the house. Please pray that we find it. And we're going for ice cream.